trust in him he will never let you down and believe in him you will never fail my dear friends in jesus christ james samson a great scientist once was asked by an interviewer this question sir which is the most perfect and the most joyful day in your life for which james replied the most perfect and the most joyful day in my life is the day when i accepted jesus christ as my lord and savior and put my complete faith in him yes if this same question were to be asked to you what would be your response we must keep reflecting in today's modern world many people most of the people think that their lives are dictated by external circumstances and they spend their entire life trying to uh, have control over this external things the things that are outside of them that's not correct it's not the external circumstances but the internal reality that is you and your faith that will help you to give take control of your directions of life my dear friends many people come and tell i believe in god i put my faith in him but nothing positive happens to me in my life and for such people i would say you have not given your 100 percentage of your life you have not given your whole heart you have not given your entire effort in the faith that you hold on to you may be having your faith but it's not steady it's only wavering faith my dear friends this is the same thing the, the readings of today asked us how deep is your faith how strong is your faith or what's the depth of your faith and this is what jesus also tells nicodemus and to each and every one of us everyone who believes in me will have eternal life unfortunately today people most of the people most of us seek for contentment of life seek for satisfaction in life through material things through the created things like money wealth fame name status and all those things we think that these are the things will give us happiness and joy the lord jesus christ today promises us eternal life eternal life not only the thing that we attain in the uh, life after but the same eternal life can be realized can be experienced by us here and now provided we have complete faith in him yes my dear friends you must have heard of uh, the three shortest uh, stories a uh, very famous stories first once all the villagers decided to pray for rain and on the day of the prayer all the villagers gathered but only one little boy brought umbrella and that's called faith second the example of the feeling of a boy a, a one year old boy when you throw him up in the air he laughs because he knows that you will catch him and that's trust and third every night we go to bed and we do not know we have no assurance that we will uh, wake up alive in the next morning and yet we keep we set alarm for tomorrow and that's hope my dear friends let us cultivate this faith this trust and this hope in our heavenly lord and master and what we must do is this that we need to give ourselves submit ourselves entirely at the feet of the lord completely and with whole heart put our trust and confidence and faith in him alone and thus we can gain eternal life eternal joy may god bless you in your efforts amen